guys back for another Quick Tip Tuesday. So today we are going to talk about how to add chapters in your YouTube video. You know what I'm talking about? Those little chapters, right? At the bottom of the video? Yeah, hold hold on. Let me let me uh let me bring down to YouTube. I'm going to show you this. Oh, all right. Cool. Cool. That's better in YouTube. All right. So take a look down here at the progress bar and you're going to see little breaks in the progress bar. And if you take your mouse and you hover over those breaks, you're going to see a little title. So how do you get that in there, right? I'm calling them chapters. I think that's what they're called. So how do you get that in there? Well, it's pretty easy. Now, if we scroll down here in the video and we check out the description, this is one of my YouTube videos here about uh, sound effects. So look at the description. I start at zero minutes and zero seconds. And then each one of these after that is a time code where if I click on it, it'll jump to that point in the video. But by keeping the zero minutes and zero seconds as the first thing that will automatically add the time code markers right here in your YouTube video. So I don't know if it matters how many spaces you put between the time code and your title there. I usually do four spaces, five spaces or a tab, whatever. I don't think it matters as long as it's in the same line there. But that's how you add in those chapter markers into your YouTube video so you can see them in the progress bar right down here at the bottom of the video. So I hope you guys found that tip helpful. I know when I first learned about that, I was like, oh, dude, this is sweet. Plus, it gives your audience a way to just jump to the points in the video that they want to see or they want to refer back to. So if you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Peace.